Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to do a tiny little baby Lush haul. I wanted to show you some products that I got um, a couple of, or a few weeks ago. Uh, I also wanted to tell you guys and fill you in on a little Lush secret that I found out about. Um, it's definitely worth finding out what it is, so make sure you watch to the end of the video and you'll actually be, it actually will affect you and it will benefit you, so stay tuned, guys. So without further ado, here is the bag. It says Lush Fresh Handmade Cosmetics. I bought a few tiny little things, but you know, just keep watching. So obviously the first thing, like this is free, like you just get like a nice little book, it just says The Naked Truth, it has all the products in there that you can buy from like soaps to bath bombs to like just cleansers and stuff. So that's that. All right, the first and I'd say most exciting thing is this. It is basically a lip scrub. And what lip scrubs are is they are designed to, you basically scrub it onto your lips and clean off all like the dead uh, skin cells or just like all the dead skin and everything and make you have nice, fresh, luscious lips like that anyone will want to kiss. So this one that I bought was bubblegum flavor. I'll show you guys what it looks like. It smells sensational. It's like a bright, bright pink colour. The camera is not doing justice right now, but it is so pink and so bright. Also, I've had this for a little while, so um, the jojoba oil is starting to sink into the sugar. But yeah, so the way it works is you just get like a little bit on your finger, like literally that much, like just a tiny bit, and you just apply like so and just scrub it in. It does help if you lick your lips before and make them a little bit wet so they're not as dry. You will get a bit of um, mess and whatever the other word is like obviously the whole thing's not, not going to stick to your lips bits and pieces will fall off so that's just like a little warning so once you've like scrubbed it all on just lick it all off because it is, it is just sugar. So that's my dessert for today. That's my um, sugar intake. That tastes, it actually tastes so delicious and it's beneficial for you. So suss that out guys. The next thing is this, okay, I don't know what to call it. It says Smuggler's Soul. And this is basically a tin of perfume pretty much. So rather than have um, like spray bottles or whatever, this lasts a whole lot longer. It's similar to having like roll on deodorant or something, but in the sense that it will last longer as opposed to spray. It also doesn't use gas. So with this one, basically all you do is you just get your finger and you just rub it in like a little bit, get a nice, um, nice little bit on your finger and you can rub it wherever you want. So in this case, I'm just gonna put a little bit on my hand, just rub it in. Obviously this will start to be green, but then you just keep rubbing it in until it goes transparent. Now this was, it smells like a little bit like lemongrass and I don't know, it just has a masculine scent to it. So guys, go have a look at this, uh, go check this out. It's also like $10 or something and it's lasted me so long and like I'm pretty much known for this smell now, so. The next thing I wanna share with you guys is, this says Buttered Brazil's Lip Balm. Um, <laughs> it just says, for best results, butter up the lips with the, um, nourishing nuttiness. So. This is obviously a lip balm, not to be confused with the perfume. Uh, you just, which one haven't I used? This one. So once again, you just rub it in to like, like your nice little, um, nice little patch on your finger. You can't really see that. I'll try and get a bit more. Anyway, once you get enough, you're just gonna put it on your um, lips. And it's literally just a lip balm. Now, I, I think this one might be made of butter. I'm not too sure but it has a cookies and cream kind of flavor to it. So don't lick it off. This one isn't like the lip scrub. This one is lip balm and you don't lick off the lip balm. That's disgusting. Although you can let people kiss you with this and then they can suffer by accidentally eating it. So, you know, that's, that's, worth, a, that's worth noting down. Now, um, so those were a couple of things that I bought. Now I am up to the part of the secret that I want to tell you about Lush that I found out. So something I didn't know about Lush is that there are so many like beautiful, wonderful products there. However, what you can do is 
let's just say you want to get some, like one of the soaps or anything uh, besides the bath bombs and like the lip stuff, you can ask for free samples of pretty much everything. Just be like, can I get a sample of this? Can I get a sample of that? And they'll hook you up in two seconds. I went into, obviously I went into Lush a while ago, but when I was in there, um, there was this girl, she was so friendly and we were like having a big chat and stuff. And um, I was like, oh, I'm, I'm sussing out this cream and that and blah, blah. And she goes, look, if you don't want to buy it, you don't have to. I'll just give you a whole bunch of free samples to take home. So she ended up um, giving me quite a few samples of some soaps. Um, the first, like, this is so cute, you guys. She made it look like a little deli kind of thing. Like, you know, it's like, it looks like a salami or something inside. And it's got the, like, price tag. This one is, this one just says maple. So, sweet Canadian maple syrup and fresh peppermint oil combined to create this candy cane scented soap to refresh your skin. So, this is the soap I'd love to share with you guys. Oh, it... It looks so pretty and it smells incredible. It actually smells like a can can. It's got that really strong minty smell, so I can't wait to use that. Oh, it's like it's my skin. I just thought that was so nice that um, girls give me all these free samples. Like, that's just so wonderful. She obviously knows I live out of home, and you know, when you live out of home, you gotta cut corners. The next one is just called uh, Movis Soap. I'm not too sure what it is. Uh, this says, this facial soap has five vitamin E rich, whatever that means, uh, wheat-based ingredients to combine with, I don't know, a whole bunch of science words, and sandalwood oil for a nourishing blend that leaves skin clean and soft. It looks, get, like, check this, guys. It looks like a bar of chocolate or a thing of cake. How hilarious. Like, there's the icing on top. There's, like, the biscuit on the outside. And then there's cake in the middle. Like, I'm so tempted to eat this. But I know I regret it. Oh, so it smells really chocolatey. Really fresh, really nutty. I really like that. I can't wait to use that one. That'll be exciting as well. I'm not going to do a tutorial on it, y'all. Like, I'm not going to be like, um, me in the bath with the soap. Like, no, no, no. I'm right. So there's that one. And just this other thing that I, oh, that she gave me some free samples of. Uh, it's called Tooth Tabs. And basically, okay, so the samples look like these tiny, cute little, whatever this is, like just, they're so adorable. In the first one, uh, this one says Miles of Smiles. So basically what they are, is you take a tablet, you crunch it up as much as you can, and then you just get a wet toothbrush. Like, you don't have to put anything on, just put like um, water on it and start scrubbing everything, and it will just turn into a nice little paste. Now, I haven't done it just yet, but she explained to me that's what you're supposed to do. So next one I have is, it's called Boom. Okay, at first it smells disgusting until you get used to it, but these ones are black, like they're charcoal. At, oh my god, at first they smell disgusting, but that smells so nice now. It smells really fresh. I can't wait to use that. And the last thing, which I was a little bit tripped out by, but this is a, this is actually a moisturiser. It's like, I would say it smells like a feminine moisturiser, if anything. Uh, I'm, I'm getting like a rose petal kind of scent. Actually, I want to use a little bit now. Put some under my nose so I can always smell it. Mmm. It is, it's really, it, it is quite feminine, I'd say. It's very soft and gentle. That smells really good, I like that. I can't wait to use that. I can't wait to use any, uh, all of these products. It's gonna be like, cray cray. So yeah, thanks so much guys for watching my little tiny baby Lush haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Do you guys go to Lush? What do you get from there? Have you got the bath bombs? Do you, can you recommend any products or any bath bombs or anything for me to try out? Um, I'm more than happy to do more videos on Lush stuff because they are pretty good. As always, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a big thumbs up and comment whatever you thought of the video below. And until my next video, I will see you soon guys. Bye!